The death toll in the alleged hooch tragedy in Bihar's Chhapra rose to nine on Friday as two more persons who were undergoing treatment at hospitals succumbed overnight. More than three dozen people from Nonia Tola village and a Maker police station in Chhapra allegedly consumed spurious liquor on Tuesday on the occasion of Nag Panchami. Several are currently hospitalized after falling sick. Kamal Mahato, 55, died after allegedly consuming country-made alcohol. He is survived by his wife and six children, including four daughters. Mahato was a daily wager and after his death, the family is completely distraught. Reema, one of Mahato's daughters, told India Today that her father drank hooch on Tuesday and his condition began to deteriorate soon afterwards. Mahato first complained of body ache and chest pain, said Reema. He was rushed to a hospital in Patna after he experienced loss of eyesight. He, however, breathed his last on Thursday. Jahani Mahato, 52, of Nonia Tola village is another suspected victim of illicit liquor. His wife Badami Devi confirmed to India today that her husband had consumed hooch procured from liquor trader Ramanand Manji, who runs an illegal liquor manufacturing unit on the outskirts of the village. She said that after her husband was taken critically ill after drinking adulterated liquor. He lost his life while undergoing treatment at Patna Medical College and Hospital. More than three dozen persons who fell ill on Tuesday had procured country-made liquor from one Ramanand Manji. The board outside his illegal liquor manufacturing unit proudly proclaims, Yahan par ek se ek daru milta hai, all kinds of alcohol available here. Manji is absconding after the incident and efforts are on to apprehend him along with two of his associates. In the wake of the tragedy, locals blocked the Muzaffarpur Chhapra Road and raised slogans against the police and administration for their alleged nexus with the liquor mafia. Locals alleged that Ramanand Manji was running the illegal liquor manufacturing unit in that area for last few years in connivance with the local police. Locals complained that police were aware of the illegal manufacturing unit but never bothered to stop it. Late on Thursday night, police raided Manji's premises and recovered a huge quantity of materials used to manufacture hooch.